Well, this guy was failing out of high school, but he promised his mother he would take a test called the SAT. Well, this guy takes it. He's, he's bombing. He's failing out of school. He doesn't expect anything. Well, he gets a 1480 out of 1600. He gets the score and his mother says, did you cheat? I swear to God, I tried to cheat, but the way the numbers were and the scantrons and the bubbles, you couldn't cheat because he realizes he's smart and he's going into his senior year. He says, I'm going to go to class. Now he starts to go to class. He doesn't hang out with who he did when he didn't go to class. He graduates, goes to a community college and becomes this massively successful magazine entrepreneur. So, well, the guy was always smart. He just needed a standardized test to unlock it. My dad said, no, that's not the story. And this is what I want you to understand. 12 years after all this guy's success, he gets a letter in the mail. It turns out the SAT board, the year he took the test, he was one of 13 people sent the wrong SAT score. His actual score was a 740 out of 16. Uh, 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 and he said, people think my whole life changed when I got the 1480. My whole life changed when I started acting like a 1480.